Hello, welcome to UWT Expert Talk. My name is Guo Yan. I am the Area Sales Manager at UWT. I'm very happy to have Nicholas here, our Product Manager, the expert for today's talk. Hi, Guo Yan. Thank you for the invitation. Last year, we had our first expert talk about our capacitive series, the Kappa Nivo. And this time, we will talk about our new radar series, the Nivo Radar. Yeah, today we are going to say hello to our new solutions of radar level measurement. High tech with 80 gigahertz. Right, so we have three new sensors. So one sensor, the new radar 4100 for solid application. So this is the addition to our existing new radar 3100 and very new. Two new sensors for liquid application. So the basic version, the Nivo Radar 7100 and the upgrade, the Nivo Radar 7200. Fantastic. Oh, if I look at the size, it is really small and compact, right? Yes, really compact. So when we compare it to a smartphone, it's even smaller than a smartphone. So really compact designed. Fantastic. So, Nicholas, can you please explain the major features and benefits of those sensors? Sure. So, let's start with the Nivo Radar for solid application, Nivo Radar 4, measuring range of 30 meters, 80 gigahertz technology, 4 degree narrow beam angle. We have no dead band in the upper area, and it's also suitable for explosive environments. No dead band? No dead wow. band. The Nivo Radar 7 series, so Nivo Radar 7100 for liquid application, mm -hmm. so the basic version, measurement range of 8 meters and blue lit, and also very compact 1.5 inch process mm -hmm. connection. And the upgrade, the Nivo Radar 7200, longer measuring range, mm -hmm. 50 meters, um, compact design. One and a half inch process connection display mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and also suitable for explosive environments. Okay, let's summarize. So, what are the measurement range once again for those three sensors? So, for the solid version, 30 meters, basic version for liquid application, 8 meters, and the upgraded version, 50 meters measuring range. Thank you very much. So, Nicholas. Uh, how can we do the sensor settings? Because a lot of customers, uh, they ask us whether we can do the sensor settings via um, smartphone or tablet. Is that possible now? We have two options to okay. configure the sensors. One option is with the display. Mm -hmm. So as you know, it just use the display for the sensor setting. Yeah. And the other option, and this is really great, we have our, our own app. So it's called the UWT Level app. Wow. It's downloadable in the different app stores uh -huh. um, for Android and for uh, iOS. Mm -hmm. And all you need is the, our app mm -hmm. and a mobile device, a tablet or a smartphone. And then you can remotely configure our new radar sensors. That's fantastic. UWT Level app, that sounds great. So. Nicholas, can you please explain how to connect the sensor with the app, how to do the sensor settings step by step? Sure. So for the communication, for the setup of the sensor, we're using a tablet mm -hmm. and we already downloaded the app. So I just press on the app icon and go to the setup. And now the app is searching for the sensor mm -hmm. to build up a communication. Yes. Takes a few seconds and wow. now the app has found our sensor. In this case, we have the Nivo Radar 7100. And now I need your help, please. I need sure. the access pin to find it on the type plate. So there's a pin number over the QR code. Is that the right one? This is the right one. Okay. So 904255. Yeah. Okay. And now the app. Again, searching for the sensor to build up a communication. Mm -hmm. And after some seconds, the, set, uh, the, the, the communication is built up and 
we can see here our dashboard with all the relevant information. Yeah. You can see the filling height. You can see also the distance to mm -hmm. the level. We have a percentage value mm -hmm. and we have also a device status that tells you that everything is okay with your device. So let, let, let me play a little bit. So if I move the sensor, wow. Here you can see how fast it really reacts. So the distance to the top of our room here, to our wall, is now Very increasing. Very fast reaction time. Great. So really, really fast. And here with all the relevant information, if you want to set up the sensor, just click on setup. And here we have the quick setup guide. So mm -hmm. only for four steps and then the sensor can be adjusted perfectly to the application. Normally we have a factory calibration, so normally okay. you don't have to do anything. What we also have, we have some extended functions where we can find echo curves, mm -hmm. where we can do some analysis of our echo, of our measurement reliability. So everything to find in the UWT level app. And I think it's really fun to use. It's really simple, really easy. And I think that this is a pretty, pretty user-friendly way to set up the sensors. Absolutely. We love it. Yes. So, Nicholas, uh, you have mentioned a lot about these new sensors. Uh, what are the targeted markets and industries? For the Nivo Radar 4, the solid version, yeah, you can use it in a wide variety of applications, mm -hmm. a wide variety of industries. So maybe food, grain, plastic, or animal feed, or even for concrete batching. Mm -hmm. So you can use it nearly everywhere. Mm -hmm. one, other, one great feature is that we do not have to care anymore about the decay value because mm -hmm. it's very sensitive. Mm -hmm. And yeah, you can install it on silos, bunkers, heap, or crushers. Mm -hmm. For the Nivo Radar 7, our liquid version, it's also yeah, very universal mm -hmm. uh, in use, food and beverage, chemical industry, oil and gas, or water, wastewater treatment. And here also a lot of opportunities to install the sensor with this compact design, one mm -hmm. and a half inch process connection in storage tanks, in stereo vessels or in dosing vessels. So there is a lot, of, a lot to find for the new radar sensors. Mm -hmm. So they are very universal and yeah that, that means they are all arounders <laughs> really arounders yes very exciting news so thank you very much nicholas and i'm also very excited and uh, it's my great honor to announce from today on those new sensors are available on our web shop please find much more on our web shop yeah Goyen, thank you for inviting me to this expert talk it was again a pleasure for me to do it for the second time with you and have fun with our new radar sensors. <laughs>